when the mean becomes misleading because of extremes or outliers, then we need some other way of saying what a typical value is. This is where we can answer our sixth question. What is the height of the students in the middle if they are arranged height-wise? We can do this by quite literally taking the middle value. This is a different sort of an average and it's called the median. Whenever median is mentioned, your first instinct should be to arrange the data in either ascending or descending order. Let us take an example to understand. To find the median of this set of nine numbers, as you can see here, we first arrange it in ascending order like this and literally take the middle value here. And that happens to be six. And that happens to be the fifth term because there are four terms to the right of six and four terms to the left of six. Now, let me add one more term to this set. Let's say I add another nine out here. Now, if I pick the fifth term as the median, there are five terms to the right and four terms to its left. Whereas, if I pick the sixth term as the median, then there are four terms to the right and five terms to its left. We know median should be a value which is exactly halfway along. So, what do we do? If you have an even set of numbers, just take the mean of the middle two numbers. That is, you add them together and divide by two. Here, you add the fifth and the sixth term, that is a value of six and seven, and divide by two to get a value of 6.5. And that happens to be your median. So to summarize, step one will be to line up the numbers in either ascending or descending order. Step two will be to determine if your data set has either an odd number or even number of values. If you have odd number of values, the median is the one in the middle. So in a set with an odd n number, the middle number is at the position n plus 1 by 2. For example, if n is equivalent to 13, the value 13 plus 1 by 2, that is 14 by 2, that is the seventh term, will be the median. If you have an even number of values, get the median by adding the two middle ones together and dividing by 2. You can find the midpoint by calculating the sum of n by 2 and n by 2 plus first term and dividing by 2. For example, if n is equal to 16, the mean values of 16 by 2 and 16 by 2 plus 1th observation, that is the mean of the 8th and the 9th observation will be the median. To keep learning with such engaging videos, download Baiju's, the learning app today.